My name is Becca radomsky bish and this is Owen. We think a lot about how we can plant around our properties in order to support birds. And one of the main reasons that we love native trees and shrubs like this red osier dogwood is because it supports lots of birds. Oh, and what kind of bird have we seen nesting in these shrubs almost every year? Gray catbirds. Yeah, gray catbirds. Bird! <laughs> Gray catbirds are one of our many migratory birds. Many of our native regional and migratory birds love trees and shrubs. They use them for nesting and foraging, even escaping predators. So if you have space on your property, consider adding a native shrub like the red osier dogwood or another variety of tree or shrub that does well in your area. This red chokeberry will produce a beautiful red berry after all the pollinators enjoy obviously the flowers that you see right now. And then it also produces a beautiful red color in the fall that makes my garden just pop. Any native tree or shrub will add some kind of beneficial uh, ecological powerhouse to your garden. All of them are important. And the reason they're important is because they are the host plants for butterflies and moths, which will lay their eggs on the leaves. Those eggs become caterpillars and 98 to 96% of all North American birds feed their babies caterpillars during nesting season. There's a couple of really great tools to research what would be a great native plant for your property in terms of trees and shrubs. The National Audubon Society has a great tool if you want to match birds to plants. National Wildlife Federation has a great tool. And my personal favorite is Lady Bird Johnson. So do some research. What kind of conditions are you going to be planting in? Shade, sun, part shade, part sun, wet soil, dry soil. Go to your local nursery, ask questions, and figure out what you're going to add. Bring it home, put it in the ground, preferably right before some rain is what's happening right now on our property. So I better get my next native plant in the ground. Good luck, enjoy your planting. You won't be disappointed by the biodiversity it supports.